20 days since the big storm swept through, causing big problems for parts of Green Country. Yeah, thousands of Tolsons still living with debris, dotting their front yard, waiting for pickup. Two News reporter Joe Hankey has a look at where the cleanup stands this morning. Joe? Well, happening today, debris pickup of debris like these piles right next to me here continues on. City crews have been working for 15 days now, working through the city, picking this green waste up. And here's a look at where things stand right now. If you are in the uh, red section on this map, your debris has already been taken away. Anyone in the green section, that's the area that the city has been working through for the last couple of days now. And the white area is areas that are still waiting to see their debris taken away. And uh, the white area, that is uh, covering Midtown. That was the hardest hit area during the storm back on July 24th. The city says it expects it will take longer to clear Midtown than any other part of the city. The free debris pickup started just days after that storm, and the city says 120 workers have been working to pick it all up. Workers started clearing debris five days a week, but are now out there six days a week after Saturdays were added to their schedule. And the last city estimate says that this pickup is going to go until about late August. They don't have any estimates uh, on specific neighborhoods or streets. Just keep your stuff out there on the uh, curbside. They are continuing to work through the city. We'll have the latest updates uh, on the uh, map and also just the latest updates on the debris pickup overall on KGRH.com and also on our mobile app. Reporting live in Midtown, Joe Henke, 2 News Works for you.